Did you know that there is a spotlight feature in Camtasia 2022? Hey everyone, how's it going? It's Jewel Tolentino here from Esatino Media. And on this channel, we show you how to create profitable content. All right, so in this video, I'm gonna show you the new spotlight feature in Camtasia 2022. So if you have the new version, they added this new feature in, and I actually have not tried it out yet. And so we're going to do that live in this video and you'll hear my reaction. All right, so I'm in the Camtasia 2022 and how you know that you're actually in the 2022 version is you want to head over to the library area and click on this drop down. And if you see Camtasia 2022, then you know you have the 2022 version. If it just says 2021 or some other year, then that's likely the version that you're in. So I'm in the 2022. I'm gonna head over to the visual effects tab because that's where the new spotlight feature is. If I like it, I'll favorite it and then it'll show up in my favorites. All right, so if we scroll all the way down to the bottom here, we will see this thing spotlight effect. Let's drag this down. I've got a test video here. I was filming some videos with my GoPro. So let me drag this down and see what this looks like. I actually have not seen what this looks like at all. So I've dragged this down and I can see that right away it kind of did like a shadowing over here and over here, kind of like on the corners. And it, it kind of is a spotlighting sort of like diagonally in the middle here. Now you can see that there are some features that pop up here. There is the opacity, brightness, and focus, and they have it set to the color white. So let's just play around with this spotlight feature and see what it looks like. Okay. So let's play around with the opacity. Let's just bring that up. Okay. Obviously it's just making it. It's just making it bright. So obviously if I go lower, it goes a little bit darker. It kind of goes in and out. I'm not sure if you guys are seeing these kind of like flashes that are happening. And of course, if you want to revert back to the original settings that they have, just click this reverse recycling arrow and it'll go back to what it originally was, which was 10%. Next is the brightness. Let's bring up the brightness. Okay, so it's going to make me bright. This is going to make me really dark. Let's go back to original. And then the focus. Let's see what this does. So that actually takes away the shadow. And then this makes it, oh, this makes it crazier. If you want it to be more harsh, you go down. And it'll be like almost gone. So it's kind of like, whoop. And let's go back to original. Let me just go over here on this knob right here. And let me just see what this does. Okay. So now I see what this does. This actually moves the shadowing effect. So you can see that it was angled like that. So it, um, you know, spotlighted me, right? But if I bring it back a little bit, you can see that makes it darker and I'll bring it here. And so you can play around with it to see like what areas you want. Obviously I wouldn't want this because then I'm, I'm totally blacked out. Right. But depending on what's on the screen, obviously I would want to highlight myself a little more. And maybe if you bring this a little bit back here and you kind of go like that. Now let's see what happens when you change the color. Like, let's see what that does. Let's just, for fun, let's just do green. Oh, cool. This is cool. This I find more interesting, actually. This little green spotlight effect here. Now it's got like a green tint. So technically, let's, let's go to purple because I think you guys know that I like the color purple. Hence what I'm wearing, right? So let's say we want to do a purple here. This is actually more exciting to me. Because if I were to do something more like this, and let's bring the opacity, brightness. So I actually, I kind of like this because this looks cool in my opinion. <laughs> it got like a cool kind of like purple overlay here. 
There's this colorize feature that will put a color over top your video, but this, uh, this is a little bit different than that. This is like, this is a little bit more natural in my opinion with adding a color on the video. So I actually really like this with the color, but if you want it to just be more of a natural spotlight, then you would go back to the white and then we'll revert back here. So that's actually really interesting. What do you guys think of it? Do you like it? If you do like it, make sure to click the star here so that it shows up in your favorites. So that is the spotlight feature in Camtasia 2022. If you guys want to see my review on the new Camtasia 2022 version, head down to the description below as I will have that video there. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video.